everybody, my name is Ginger, Ginger Nutty, Ginger, you whatever version you would like, and today we're playing some Dragon Quest VIII Journey of the Cursed King. So, let's go into how we leveled up. So, because we have done some leveling up. So, we just shoved all of uh, the hero's experience points, uh, oh, leveling up points into Courage, Yanga, so we put them all into sides. Angelo, we shoved them all into bows and staves. We put bows at 54, didn't earn anything, um, nor did the hero, I don't think, no. Um, but it just means if we did want to use the Seed of Skill, he would then have 59 on bows, which means that he can do more critical hits. And Jessica, we shift them all into staves. Angelo and Jessica both learnt something on staves, which increases their maximum HP by 20 and 100 points respectively. Jessica, 100, obviously. And Angelo, um, 20. Yes, so let's get into rank B. Again. After the level up. Let's hope. Let's hope it did something. It should have done. Ladies and gentlemen, the Monster Arena is proud to present a rank. Right. Let's, Let's go. In. We will do this. I am. It's a fight. That Duncan will cast Umph on Talos, and Cura will not die. I mean, Duncan died not that, but I am. Don't fail me now. Busy for the next couple of rounds. On Talos, on Talos, on Talos, on, oh, oh, on yourself. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. It means still Talos and Duncan are doing the same thing. Don't die. Curek, full heal, please, please. On Talos. We need Talos' damage to survive. We need Dumpkin's damage to survive, so I don't get me wrong. Oh, heal himself or Dumpkin? Cura, quote unquote, in theory, in theory, shouldn't be attacked as much as Talos and Dumpkin are. It's just uh, the way that the mechanics work. Like Angelo is less likely to be attacked than Yangus and the hero, and Jessica is less likely to be attacked than three, but there are only two focus solely on the last one. Oh, Angelo, you can take that as you will. Ah, uh, fuck. Ah, uh, fuck, no. This is, this is grim. This is the hardest Alba 3 in my opinion. I've always thought that. Good. Fuck. Imagine if that killed. I would have died. I don't think we've got another cure in us. There. Looking at his MP, I think we're out of full heals. I'll double check, but the golem in this the form can be particularly dangerous. The teams are in the red corner. We have in the blue corner. It's a campaign of pain.
Okay. Yeah, we've got another cure in it. This is shit. That's that's awful as well. That's rock lot. So if we die, we're in top. Or if we, we're getting close to each other with us. Boss troll be nice to us. Yeah, we're not gonna win this other one. It's just got the overwhelming feeling that we're not gonna survive. Good, Stone Guardian's down. The only thing that was keeping us afloat for the majority of the time. Oh wow, that's seven damage to load. It's exactly seven. Fuck. Duncan can just do up on Talos before he dies, that would be great. The golem down, that's absolutely fine, I'm taking that. We just do up on Talos before he dies, that would be great. Talos, 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 Talos. Yeah. That um, should carry us for the rest of this round. Hopefully, that fight did. He, uh, he did what I asked him to do. Hopefully, we should get some damage next round out of it as well. It's the moment. This is the final we'll round. We'll see. We'll see though, because this round In isn't easy either. Corner. In the blue corner, tap. The rock and roll. Down into the pit. We'll there you go. See. Let's see what happens. Fingers crossed. Right, getting that out of the way will be nice. When we I don't know if we can. I don't think we can, but. Which way around is that? It's a Talos v Talos! Right. That's one out of the way. Well, Talos can just stomp on everyone, that would be great. Jura is here just as emotional support right now. Good. Right. Oh. Right, this is just a force of attrition at this point. We did it. We fucking did it. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell. How we survive that, I do not know. This team isn't going to be useful. Well, they, they, I mean, they can, in theory, win, but we're not going to accept that. We, with our strong the monsters. The most spectacular performance. This is the prize for winning rank B. Congratulations. A Bardashi of Binding. That is a size. I knew it! I set the target, and it's like the red rag to the bulls, eh? <laughs> Ragazzo. Ragazzo! <laughs> I keep my promise. I give you the prize. You will be the only one in the world to have this privilege. Ragazzo. Ragazzo. You, and only you will be the owner of not one, but two teams of the monsters. Just think about it. With the two teams, you will be formidable in the outside world. You could have the one team for attacking, Do not... and the other no. team for the healing. No. I... 
You make the different combinations. That is the worst thing possible. This means we must give the name to your new team. If you cannot think of a good... Yes. So, you want to... Okay, so... I've done this twice. Um, this is the third time. I'm thinking... No, it's fun. Just gonna double check the spelling, because God knows I'm awful at it. Phantom. Because when they come out, you'll never see it coming. You'll see. Okay. Yes. That's your name. Oh, so, I did C's, but it just looked a bit weird. You so, Phantom Thieves works fine for me. So, we are now going to go and get some creatures. So, monster team. We want to change to... Keeper. Un. Blade Wolf. Other way around. Keeper. Uh, Blade Wolf. Yeah. Because it's 214, that's the second highest. That 193 is the highest. Like, of the other one. Oh, actually, Dunkin' Stronger. That's insane. Listen reserves. Yes. Goldman swap for Dunkin'. And then we put in Goldman. Right, so there's a couple of ways we need, place, a couple of places we need to go. We need to go to Mini Me Mini Meadows. No, we need to go to Princess Minnie's Island. We need to go to the Dark Ruins, and we also need to go to Neos. So we'll go to. The Dark Ruins first. This is the physically strongest enemy in the game. The one that rivals Talos in terms of his pure strength. And it's only available after you've beaten rank B. Such that like, Talos is only is only be it's obtainable after rank a D. This is only available after rank B. Get uh, to crack and crackle and uh, sizzle before you even got crack and uh, sizz because uh, that's how the game mechanics work. And I find that genuinely hilarious. Right over here. Where is he? There, there they are. Call me a little one. Manatons. Let's go. Oh yeah. Yep, he can attack twice a turn and does over a hundred damage each time. Obviously, except for the exception of metal monsters and people that have really high, like, uh, HP. God, he does not like Blade Wolf, does he? Blade Wolf can't even get a chance to attack. So 
some, not, he doesn't always attack twice a turn. He can sometimes just attack once a turn. But really, really great uh, person to have on your team. On who? I'm happy about that. They're not happy it's just done that. On who? Alright. That's what I want to see. Uh huh. Right. Just don't cast it again. Just attack for me, dumb kid. Oh, he did it! He's quite strong as well. A yes, 310 attack. Oh, he's going straight in our main team to fight alongside Talos. Move over, Blade Wolf. It is Skeletoid. And this he's stronger than Blade Wolf, isn't he? Yeah. So that's our team. Those are our two teams. So now we go Princess Minnie's castle, and then we'll go to. We really, it's on the beach that we need to go. But Neos is closer than Argonia. We don't need to go in. So why the fuck have I gone in? I don't fucking know. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. And with this, we can beat rank A. And there is another team I will be creating um, for rank X. Um, I'm going to try with the team that we'll be getting, but obviously, I've never even seen that. I've had my team before. I've gone the wrong way entirely, haven't I? Yeah, I've gone the wrong way entirely. We need to go to the beach, which is actually this side. There he is. There's the boy. A Gigantus. Gigantus gangster. Sterapes, I like to call it. Only because that's his actual, like, person name. He has got tons of HP. So the slashing viciously is just like, uh, Talos with his, uh, fists and his feet. He has tons of HP, but can fall asleep easily, so that's fine. Oh gorgeous, is he? Oh gorgeous, is Skeledoid. Ah, oh. stunning. He's only silver, but he's darn good. So yes, like 888 HP, and that will still keep going up. I think it's a maximum of 970. I could be wrong though. Right, let's go to Neos now. Okay. So our ship's there, isn't it? Yeah. So this one we won't be using past, this one's going to replace Cura. Um, we are not going to use this person past uh, the Monster Arena. Um, because I don't want it to be do that stupid AI thing which is healing someone that's already fully healed, etc. So, well, I mean we can try, it's no harm. But when they've only got three turns, I'd rather people that can strike harder and faster um, strike, you know. I've got a hair in my mouth, but I don't know where I'm from. I don't know. Oh no! We're gonna get an enemy before we land, are we? Oh no, we don't. Sound perfect. Perfecto. 
Right, we need to cast Holy Protection now. And because the beach is quite big, we are just gonna grab Borum as well. I call it Borum, it's not Borum, but it's Borum's Bell. Okay, so where is this creature? There they are. And it is Octavius Maximus. I mean, he walked toward us. Surely he should, he should be able to... to Good. So he's got a little bit more HP than Kira has, as you can tell, because he's being able to stand up or up for more than attack. And attacks a lot, a lot stronger than Kira does as well. I mean, he's not a Skeledoid, he is, he is very much still a healer, but... <clears throat> yes. Okay, so our final team will be... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me, Talos or Skeledoid. Can use either. Because Skeledoid is weaker in terms of his base attack, but it, it, have, it does attack twice, so it does make up for it. Um, Skeledes, Steratops, who is just really strong uh, in terms of HP and also uh, aggression. Um, and then Octurian. And then Team 2, I can put Talos in. Talos, Blade Wolf, and Capers usually what my team one was so really very strong teams so now let's go to the monster arena we may struggle but the reward is really really good and i really want the reward the reward is a, a, a better spear for the hero um so his multi slash is going to be off the fucking chart I don't know why, I always feel bad swearing in the street in this in these recordings. Only these ones, like I don't care about any others. What was it doing? I was looking at the stats of the spears. So the demon spear is 86 attack and the hero spear is 100. And the hero spear can do um, healing 25% of the damage inflicted we get back as HP. The other booths don't sell anything and I really feel like they should one of them should be an item shop. There must be bettings to be fair. The girl wings the rank A Y R P in position. It's showtime girls Ladies and gentlemen, the Monster Arena is proud to present a rank A battle! Let's hit! Let's go! There's our new team, look at them go! Hit. You can win, effectively, with, um... It's gonna be a top with fight Talos. fight that's out of sight! Let's get it on! Let's just, let's just... Let's get my, get my thought processes straight here, because my mind is all over the place, and none of it is a good place. Um... You can win with Talos and Cura, <laughs> but you really should replace Dumb King with Steropes. And Octuring just can strike with a stronger force, so as can as can fucking Skeledoid with that. We probably could replace therapies with uh with Alos. Because we've got similar HP. It's just that therapies can do desperate attacks really more often. But you can already tell how how strong this team is in comparison. If we lose this one, I will, like, replace Starkey. I think it's because you can, uh, Starkey's will level up with you, whereas Talos doesn't. 
but 50 is far more than 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 Jura would ever do. So Ultrian is definitely a worthwhile investment. The problem is he can use waste his MP by doing multi thrust, and that does mean he's a bit weaker. We're doing alright, we're doing okay. Okay. This is so strong. Yeah. Oh, Jura in this great. Definitely a worthwhile investment. I think the better with Jura, but you know, Jura does have advantages, is a lot more able to dodge and things like that, so it you know. Weigh up what your best opportunities are. But this is the team I hate going against, purely the simply because I love Great Saber Cats and I love my Jumping Jackals and my Blade in the red corner. That I have to face against two of them. In the blue corner. But it's Tom from it's Chateau Felix. So I thought it would be two Saber Cats, really, but it's only one. But that, these, these are from Baccarat region, essentially. They're a lot stronger than the ones in Baccarat region, let me tell you. Very nice, thank you. There we go! Wow, definitely. Good. Look at Starkey's go. Right, uh, that's round two. Let's go on to the final round. The moment we've all been waiting for. It's the, the monster you are about to win. In the red corner. In the blue, In the blue corner. corner. Captain. A man. Which side will soon be a factor? The bombarder is quite difficult, uh, so it's better to have Sterapes than Talos here. Or just get, you know, everyone to attack it first. I mean, it's not weak, it just has a little bit more defense. Yeah, that's the only problem with our skill, Odoi. We don't have the ability to use uh, Crackle Slash and things like that or Thunder Slash. So that's the only disadvantage. Yeah, the Trevil should be really next because in the wild, I don't know if we can do it here, but they can use the um, uh, Yai Grass Leaf. Oh, we're definitely going to be here. Therapy is definitely... Skeledoid definitely is going to be here. Therapy is fine. No! Good. Good. Look at that guy. I would have healed, but alright. Ouch. Good. gonna die. Oh no. Just survive.
Really? I mean, I know it's the final round, we could probably win with Sterakis, but, oh god, no. <laughs> I did not want to lose Skeledide. Don't know why, I just did. Sterap there are three giants around, Sterapis is definitely the strongest of the three. Well, and it's the I didn't one see that coming. I've been in this job a fair old while. Let me tell you, but this is the first time I've ever seen anyone make it to rank A. Here's your prize. Well done. Thank you. Fantastic. Thank you. Ma Mia, I never thought I would see to live the day. You are one chip of an old block, eh? When we are first met, it was just by chance. But now, now I know it was meant to be. You believe in me, and you give it your best shooting, eh? Now, look at what the passion and the gusto have become. I have nothing more to give you. Ragazzo. <laughs> but I can offer you one final challenge. Fight me! Become the strongest monster team owner in all the world! Our passionate encounter will take place here, in my monstrous pit! This is the final rank! Rank S! In rounds one and two of Rank S, you will fight against the two strongest monster teams I ever see! Except mine. And in the final round, you will fight me! Okay, ragazzo! It is time for you to show just what you are made of. Passion versus passion. Gusto, Gusto versus Gusto. And don't think I will be going easy. I don't wish you the buona fortuna. Wow. Now, we are rivali. I we will be rivali. waiting for you in so, my pit. in theory, you can beat that uh, Mori's team with the team of Stel Steropes, Skeledoid, and um, Octurion. Um, but you need a critical hit from a desperate attack from Steropes to make it really, like, valuable. Um, we are gonna leave him like this for now. I'll maybe change up Turin out for someone else. Uh, what, what does... No, what does Hugzilla do? In terms of... Times three. Dumb King. Three turns. Brick Man. Three turns. Gold Man. Three turns. Uh, yeah, well, let's get our Turin in then. At least it's then four turns. Okay, so. Hero Spear, 100 attack, and so it does far more than the Demon. Because that's 208, and this is 222. So, it really does help a lot as well. It's the strongest, one of the strongest spears in the game. Um, I, the only thing there's one, one or two better. I think there's only one better than the uh, Hero Spear. But if you don't want to use the Monster Arena, that's absolutely fine. You don't get that hero spear you can happily go along with the demon spear and you'll get you'll do tons of damage um still but i like to use the monster arena because i like to have two monster teams uh, right let's go and heal up first because we've got a, we've taken a lot of damage and then we can go to uh we can do a side quest I know it's a side quest in this game, uh, but we will be doing that in the next episode. But I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal and save.
Brilliant. Yeah. So I'm going to say that my name has been that one dude. You've been watching me play Dragon Quest Eight: Journey of the Curse King. If you enjoyed, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to bed because I'm tired. I'm going to do divination beforehand though. So we've got uh, 19,000, 18,000, 22,000, and 22,000. Okay. So I'm going to save. Don't look at the time as usual. But I've done all my farewells. Hopefully I will see you in the next one. Um, if I don't, I'm really sorry. <laughs> But hopefully I'll see you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed and have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye, guys.